I saw this rain coming and I sit through the whole rain. It was like few hours, you know, just to see the change of colors. And um, kind of after the rain stopped, also I sat for a little bit to see how things are changing. I think uh, meanwhile I fell asleep. <laughs> I was you know, just sitting and staring at one point for a long time. And uh, <laughs> my mom was looking for me. <laughs> And she couldn't find where I was. Like you know, then she's seeing me sitting in the rain, sleeping with an umbrella. And then he, she, I think they decided this guy is not going to change it. <laughs> <laughs> so where did they? Did they send you to art school? <laughs> uh, yeah, after that, yeah, yeah, I went to uh, study photography in uh, Melbourne. At this point of time, in this last few years, of, uh, what I am noticing is like many people are going back to their land or to, it doesn't have to be their native land or where they come from, it could also be where they really want to settle or they want to do something with the land or how they can relate to the nature back again. And, uh, and this movement, is happening I think uh, throughout the cities and throughout different countries like going back to the nature making cultivating eating good food like you know being it's um, next uh, state to Kerala mm -hmm. and I've got a land there so making a cultural sort of a place like I mean we're working with architects artists farmers trying to use all natural architecture like try to avoid the cement to the maximum and that would also give a bit of an idea to the villages and stuff too when people are coming into the photos um, I also look at the land behind them and that's very important how they are related to the land and um, all the portraits are try to be like as human as I can like try to bring that quality of uh, humaneness. With naked eye is like to be, to be in, uh, uh, in different times of your life, like and watching. And the practice is, you know, what you do, like to practice uh, and train yourself uh, to frame, to contain everything into the frame, you know, which is uh, in reality, it will be a different thing but you know to contain something into the frame is you know take times and uh, after a while it just become in a way your own nature to frame things to look at things in a certain way in certain colors you are already seeing a finished image and you know taking a photo so I really believe like uh, um, in that thing like or not just like capturing a moment or something a moment which can we can recreate it it's been a bit of a thing for me now I'm watching um, even here I now work a lot with this guy then gives me that backdrop to uh, create the drama inside We always bring an experience with us when we go to a, any other, any place like there is uh, that experience of living, experience of being your and then practicing. So it is good to come and uh, test yourself in another place if, if this work, if this are correct, you know, is it. So it might take a little time but at, and at the same time you yourself is a bigger thought which which can which you can spread to people which other people can get and I, you can also learn from them like uh, here I learn I mean so many little little things you know how you take care of things are very beautiful like how people how the houses are done um, 
I mean, I come from India, it's different, you know. So, the, and the, how carefully you keep the space and the nature. You cut your trees, you plant it back, beautiful. Something I can take back. <laughs> <laughs>